All right, guys, in this video, let's see how to access a child component's properties and methods in a parent component class using the view child decorator. Earlier in this course, we have seen how to access a DOM element in the template using the view child decorator. Accessing a child component is very similar. So let's dive right into the code. First step, create a property that will hold a reference to the child component. I'm going to call it child component ref. And this is of type child component. Make sure to import it as well. Second step, we add the view child decorator. Add view child and we pass in child component as the argument. Again, make sure to import view child from angular slash core. Third step, we need to implement the after view init interface as that is when the child component reference is available. So export class app component implements after view init. Again, make sure to import it. Now let's define the ng after view init method. So ng after view init and within the body, this dot child component ref dot message is equal to message from parent component. If we save this and take a look at the browser, we should have the message message from parent component. So from the parent component, we are accessing a property that is defined in the child component using the view child decorator. All right, with that, we wrap up component interaction with a child component. Let's take a look at parent component interaction in the next video. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next one.